Hey, we're back for another studio vlog. Woo! -hoo. Okay, I got my coffee with this beautiful mug that a friend made for me. It is totally glitterized because I love glitter. Can't get enough glitter. Check it out. It's super cute. And because I love Edna Mode. Okay. So things I'm doing today. Easter stuffed animals because Easter is around the corner. I have someone ordered a lamb and a bunny stuffy. Each one of them is holding a little heart and it has a name written across the heart. So we're gonna get those done today. Bunny should be no problem. I made 30 plus, oh God, I don't know how many I made for the children's hospital last year. So bunnies do that in my sleep, so not a big deal. Also, um, I'm wearing my normal uh, work attire, which when I go to work, I dress up with a good old t-shirt. I just wanna show you because I love this shirt. This shirt is the story of my life. There's always, in my house, always someone crying. Sometimes it's me. I mean, that's just what it is. Uh, we're currently short-staffed. I have about only two therapists out of like eight that have been showing up lately. So it is literally just me. Uh, school just got canceled till the end of the year for us. So also just me. Um, no help. I actually didn't realize how much I don't get done. <laughs> I don't have assistance. Um, that sounds really bad. But um, I have kids who are on the spectrum and so they qualify as special needs. And uh, because of that, I do get a lot of extra help, which I never realized how much I actually used or needed until everybody's home and no one's coming over. Like, holy cow. I didn't know how much of a break I got when they went to preschool in the morning and had people helping them there or when they had people helping them at home. Just a little side note, I'm gonna do a little quick tangent. Um, my kids need help with literally everything. I have a five-year-old, a three-year-old, and a one-ager, and um, the toddlers, definitely need help with literally everything like they are not self-sufficient in any way shape or form of the word I gotta do everything from clothes to feeding them to like little things like we're finally learning how to throw things in the trash can but we still don't know how to clean up after ourselves and I still have to wash their faces and brush their teeth um, which I know maybe you're saying yeah my kids do too I have toddlers and they also can't like brush their own teeth but like literally everything um, mine don't even have uh, verbal skills so we do a lot of tantrums and a lot of me not understanding what they need and doing a lot of moms guessing what's happening right now and so it's a lot of extra things that maybe maybe are relatable maybe not but just know that it's just me as a me and three kids all the time and so I don't usually get well now I haven't had as much time to be as productive as I normally am so but things are finally kicking up at so magical and I've had a lot of people finally starting to like regain confidence in the system or whatever and I'm starting to put in all those orders online so I'm so happy and I'm so happy so let's work Okay, so I wanted to show you something that I actually got in the mail. I got some new fabric. I'm not gonna be using it for Sew Magical. I'm actually going to use it to sew for my other store, m and Every Day. But if you've been following me long enough, you'll know that if you wanna order anything from any of my shops, all you have to do is send me a DM and you can order anything. Whether or not I'm selling it specifically in Sew Magical or not is irrelevant. 
but you will not find these fabrics used on anything that is going to be in the So Magical Etsy store. But if you want it, you can always ask me and I'll send you a PayPal invoice or you can just Venmo me and we'll get it sorted out. But let's take a look at the goodies that came in today. All right, cool. Let's open this up. I mean, I already know what it is, but you have no idea what it is. So let me show you. I'm so excited. It's a little... I don't want to rip it or cut the fabric. And it sounds like there might be some tissue paper in here. So I don't want to ruin the experience. No, it's not. Okay, you ready? Order this. Cool. Yes. If you are a Stranger Things fan, you will recognize this fabric. I've actually used this to make a bag for my niece already, but I needed more because I actually underestimated how much I was gonna like it once I actually made it into something. But yeah, super cool. This is a custom printed fabric. The artwork is done by the woman who sells the fabric and the only way to get this fabric for me is to find someone who will sell it to me who already purchased it because she doesn't rerun her fabric. So she prints it and sells it the one time and then never again. So if you want some, you have to hope that someone's nice enough to sell some of their stash to you. The other one that I got is this is actually Avatar themed. <laughs> And I mean Avatar as in the movie. Hey guys, so it's tomorrow. We made our bunnies and I realized I left you guys hanging on our talk of this Avatar fabric, which is super cute. Okay, so my camera died. Totally didn't realize it. So I was talking to myself for like, another bit and a half so uh, you know no shame um, I, what I was trying to tell you that you didn't see uh, I wanted to know what do you think I should make with this I thought of maybe doing perhaps a bag um, I've made one bag before that I've shared with you guys I did make this cute guy it would be able to work for something like this um, I've also made some other bags that cut like a beauty bag where you can open up top, you look inside and like all your products are in there. They fit all the like Too Faced palettes, that's what I have, um, fit in there. Or maybe like a little carry along, I don't really want to say a wallet, but like a tiny clutch with maybe a little like cut out window with just this print. I don't know. What do you think? I always get fabric and the way I determine what it should be is I wait for the fabric to speak to me and it tells me what it wants to be. And I'm not sure, this was more of an impulse. I really loved the vibrant colors, but I'm not sure what it's meant to be. If you have an idea, go ahead and leave me a comment. I'm open to suggestions. Anyways, onwards. We need to talk about bunnies, okay? So, this is the bunny we made yesterday. The one that we worked on together, really cute. This is gonna be my snow bunny. Um, and then we have an ivory bunny, ivory, snow. See the difference? One is, a, the snow white is a lot whiter. I needed to make a second bunny because I want to take some photos to update Etsy. I do have a few to make this beautiful ivory bunny. And uh, I did change my turnaround times because it's Easter. I want everyone to be able to have the opportunity not to feel like Easter was canceled so I know maybe we can't spend it in person, but we can let someone know that some bunny, get it, is thinking of them by sending them a really cute bunny. Again, doesn't have to be for kids. Send it to your loved one. Maybe you can be around grandma. Um, we did do one that if you look on our website, we do have a grandma uh, example. I don't mean like it's a grandma bunny, but I mean it's one that says Grandma Missy on it. I mean, it's, it's a cute bunny. She's mint. It's adorable. Actually, I think just look at my feed. Go ahead and look at my Instagram feed. I think that's where it's living now that I think about it. I did not, did not list it on Etsy. So, scratch what I said. Check out my Instagram feed from this time last year and all you'll see are bunnies, bunnies, bunnies. So, got the bunnies done. 
I do have some of this ivory. I'm only gonna be able to make what I have left because we just got a statewide like shutdown yesterday. So I don't think I'll be able to go to the fabric store. So I'll do what I can with what I have. I also have brown for brown bunnies. I may have some gray. I mean, there's a lot of stuff that I have because I hoard fabric. So if there's something you're looking for, like message me, we'll figure it out. Um, I'll go ahead and show you a picture of our brown bunnies and maybe our other colored bunnies and just show you things that I've done, you know, in case you are like me and I probably wouldn't go to your Instagram feed and scroll, 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 so let's make life easy. Um, other thing we made was our beautiful little lamb. This lamb's also going out. These two are going out as a set, so I hope those little girls or older girls or whoever loves them. I love this one, this little guy. I don't know if you can see him. Can you tell that there's flecks of silver in the fabric? Oh, it's so soft. This little lamb is so understated. Like, seriously. I didn't get too many orders for her last year, but she's the cutest little thing I've ever seen. I know the bunnies are popular, but this little lamb doesn't get enough love. Other thing. If you haven't seen it already on Instagram, I went ahead and posted a short video about our snow bunny. Snow bunny is extra, as you can tell, they both say the name Cora. I just used the same pattern and name to make a sample for myself. But she needs a home. She needs to find a Cora for herself. I'm giving this away for free. If you can message me, this snow bunny will be mailed within the US, guys. In the US, because we gotta be within reason here. I'm not a millionaire. To send this Cora to her Cora and let her know that some bunny is thinking about her. So if you know a Cora or know someone that knows a Cora, please tag them, send them this video, do whatever you can to get the message across. I will ship this for free. I haven't done anything really free in a while, but I think I'm gonna start doing this because I always end up making like bibs that have to be personalized or like, yeah, my baby's crying. Hold on, hold, hold that thought, just one second. Okay, sorry about that. <laughs> Momentary hiccup. I accidentally set off and reset the internet and the Looney Tunes stopped playing. So, you know, <laughs> mass hysteria. You thought this whole thing going on now was something to panic about. Just wait till the Looney Dude stops playing on the TV. Talk about real panic. Okay, like I said, I'm looking for a home. Also, um, right now, my bunnies, my lamb, and my other bunny, this bunny. This bunny has a little rainbow that she holds real close to her heart. And yes, we have a guest with us now because she was still rather upset about the Looney Tunes fiasco, so yeah, it is what it is. Right now she's uh, pretending to do her homework. One agers, man. You know, it's a rough year. It's a rough, rough one year of their life. <laughs> okay, so since not everyone's into pink, I do have this color available and I can use this fabric to make this bunny. So, like I said, I'll work with you. We'll figure it out. Um, but all of these bunnies and our lamb are all currently on sale. I'm going to leave a link in the description for our sale tab, which changes every month. I'm going to extend, since today is the last day of March, I'm going to extend the sale on the bunnies and the lamb so that way people can still get their Easter gifts in. I've shortened the turnaround time so I can try to pump out as many as possible. You know, it's just everything's been such a bummer lately. Like, I think just sending someone some happy mail, maybe we can kind of just like turn the vibe around. So that's my hope anyway. I'm also gonna link individually to each of the items. So like the lamb will have its own link also in this description in case you're watching this and they're no longer part of the monthly sale. You can always go and find them anyway. So we're gonna wrap it up here. It's time. Again, help us find Cora, please, before Easter. Other thing, uh, subscribe, like, share, follow me on the Instagram, follow me on the Facebooks, follow me on all the places. Favorite my shop on Etsy. Um, pin some of my stuff onto your Pinterest boards. Hey, let's spread the love. Let's get all these cute little bunnies and lamb pictures out there. And I enjoyed spending this time with you. I hope to see you next time. And don't forget, I greatly appreciate every single one of you. Thank you so much. <laughs>